Shadow Week Division. What up, guys? Welcome back to Bless Breakdowns. And, um, uh, uh, uh it, this guy's gotta be debuters, right? Let's see. Okay, main card. Let's start it off. Oh, look, David Grant. David Grant, how is he not on the main card? That's weird. Oh, Mark Adeskis is on this card too. That's pretty cool. It's a lot of fights. Main card. Um, let's just see. I didn't really get to watch none of these guys. Really, they're probably like one and all, two, two and all in, in the UFC. Strikes landed. 3.58 significant strike line 48 percent absorb per minute 3.1 tree defense is 59 percent what is the grappling oh, oh this guy might be a little bit more of a submission guy um i'm not too too keen on both guys guys i couldn't really tell you guys yeah i'm not sure just looking out for stats i mean it looks like Josh is a little bit more of a stand-up guy and Le Leon is more of like might be a striker might be an MMA guy so we see what happens there'll be a lot of frisky fights on this card yeah should be uh I don't know who to lean more towards um off of strikes him being undefeated I would say lean towards Leron Murphy but don't listen to me that's terrible Jai Herbert and Farah Ziam 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 I Strikes landed grappling That's that last fight draw last fight win 156 They kind of look alike They they, they kind of do right they kind of look related They kind of they kind of look related not really, not really keen on uh, uh, both of these people. I didn't watch too much fights. Uh, Jai, Jai gonna win. Jai Herbert, Jai Herbert. A bunch of you guys in the chat saying Jai Herbert, so I guess I gotta roll with the chat on this one. Let's go, Jai. Yeah, Jai got better striking and pop. Let's go. Let's roll with Jai then. Lightweight, lightweight fight. Rolling with Jai. Thank you guys. You look good. Significant strikes and stuff look good. Land per minute almost three. They almost e equal in all of this as all per minute except for absorb he absorbs three that means he put himself out there more a little bit more striker so you love to see it Jai for sure paul craig okay i know this guy paul craig is the man if you guys remember watching uh when jamal hill he fought jamal hill and jamal he like he broke jamal's hero's arm in a fight for doing the arm bar so it's very jujitsu -y. Oh, they're both coming off of losses. Andre. Andre Muniz. Andre Muniz. Take down defense. Significant strikes. The fact that I actually watched Paul Greg fight. He has a win over over uh, over the former 205 champ. I got what Paul Greg. High level. This is going to be a high level uh, Jiu-Jitsu match should be. That's great. That's great to hear. It's this guy. It's really high level. So be great. Sick. Paul is uh, something else. He's a wizard on the ground. I'm sure this guy's a wizard on the ground. Andre. I'm sure you're wizard on the ground and um, let's see it on to the next one guys my man Nathan Wood versus Andre Feely we can't we can't ever go against the Oos Andre Feely bro look at his tats bro this guy is tatted bro he's crazy that tattoo on his neck it's, it, it's actually insane but you can't go against I can't go against my Oos bro I gotta go by, by him I gotta ride with him bro I gotta rock with him Andre Fili, what, what, like his last fight win? Who who did he fight last? El El Lijo. El Go. I got Andre Fili. I got the shit of ring. Uh, ring with him it was one of the fun fights early in my career. <laughs> this guy is always in the fight of the night kind of battles. He'd go out there, he you know, he dies on his sword, bro. He he, he never ever gonna die on his shield. He he goes out there dying on his sword. So this should be a fun fight. Nathan Wood, I heard of him. I heard a super exciting fight, uh, fighter, so we see what happens. Uh, a bunch of you guys going, Eric, you going Woods. I can't go against my Philly, so we're going there. We're going Andre Philly. 
Should be firecracker though. Some of you guys are going for woods. See it. Oh, Molly McMahon, the people's elbow. This is the one that is the people's elbow, right? That's the one that she got permission to use the people's elbow from, from The Rock. If it's a striking match, if this girl's a striker, this should be a really fun fight. Julija. Stolarenko. Stolarenko. Julija. Stolarenko. I think that's how I say it. Julija. Stolarenko. Like a stand up fight? I think it's gonna be fun. Meatball. Yeah, people's elbow. You gotta go with meatball. Good ground game. If it's a. If it stays on the feet, I'm going McMahon. But by the way, you guys make it sound that if it goes to the ground, Julicha Stolarenko is gonna take it. So hopefully, Molly can keep this fight up, get a W. Uh, her last fight was a loss. Uh, they're both actually coming off of losses. So hopefully, she can keep this on the feet, go out there, get the job done, and. Uh, Get another W inside that column, you know? We see what happens. We're rolling with uh, Molly in this one, I guess. My oh, man. And if you guys don't know, the big heavyweights. Tom Aspino. Aspino. And Mar I, I, I'm not too familiar with Tybra. What is Tybra? What is, what is, what is Tybra? What, is he a striker? Wrestler? Grappler? Because I know Tom is a striker, right? Tom striking is like like really good, right? Tom by domination. A lot of you guys going Tom. Take down defense 100. Take down accuracy 100. Whoa, look at these guys' stats. Yeah, I guess I guess you got to roll with Tom in this one. Tom taking it. Tom taking that in your opinion. Okay. Okay, chat. You decided. We're going Tom. Tom S. Pennell. Try and write it down. Try to see if I can pronounce it. Tom S. S. Pennell. Versus Markin Tybra. Tybra. Tom doesn't go past one tree. Doesn't go past one tree. Well, guys, I guess I got to go with you guys. I guess I got to go with you guys. We're going Tom. I guess we're going Molly. Some of you guys are going Wood. But I got to go, go with my Oost Andre Philly. High level grappling match here. I got to ro rock with Craig. He's number nine. Oh, they're actually number nine at 14 in the middle. Wow, crazy that they're so low. Jai. We're running with Jai. You guys saying Jai's striking is, is super good. And uh, this one... I don't really know what way to lean, guys. You guys can pick, so shit happens. Should be an exciting card. I, I like cards like these. Cards like these that usually slept on usually always have like the most craziest fights. So I think so. We're in for a treat. Another another UFC weekend uh, is ahead of us, and it should be fun. Thank you guys for watching, guys. Let's get it. On to the next. Well, all of always stream stream. With that said, I need to go and uh, I'll see you guys later. Peace out.